Hello, my friends of Hattery Labs. Welcome to this tutorial. This tutorial will be a uh, quick but very easy to add a uh, Google layer, uh, Google map in QS3. QS3. Okay, so what is the problem? As long as you remember, if we were in QS2, like we had the Open Layers plugin, but if you here we have the QS3. And in QES3, there is no open layers plugin. Okay, there are no any other plugins related to Google Maps. So how do we add a um, Google Map into our project, in, uh, into our Canvas? Uh, this is kind of very easy, but uh, it's very easy if you know how to do it. Okay, first of all, there is new a new fancy thing that is called XYZ tiles, okay? And here is where you add the server that provides the Google Maps. So by default, you co it comes with the OpenStreetMap. So actually, if you double click here, it gives you the OpenStreetMap. Yeah. And like, for example, here is a, is a map that is from OpenStreet. What, what, what will happen if we if I instead of the open street map I would like the Google map so for this uh, there are several uh, web addresses that we will provide in the description of this video yeah um, this web address will be Okay, so in order to provide the, the the Google Maps, we have to insert a new connection. We have we have to insert a new connection. Okay, so the new connection there are several maps, so we can insert a roadmap. So let's let's add a roadmap here. And let's say this is the web address for the roadmap okay so this so actually we what we have done is we have added the the roadmap to the to the repository of xyz tiles so this is the roadmap and for example if we want to see a terrain this is there is another address for the terrain new connection Okay, this is for the terrain. So actually we added to our project. So instead, do you see the difference? This is the terrain and this is the roadmap. This is the terrain. Okay, so we can have uh, just the satellite image. So for example, here we establish a new connection. This is the satellite. And this is... Um, It is yes, is with S. So let's see. And then this only has a satellite. Is actually do not have any other layer. Okay. So as you see, there is on the description of this video, you will have seven, seven, no, like six different type of. You will have six different type of layers that actually you can add to the QA to your Q. Yeah. Okay, and uh, this is the way. This is the new way that it has been implemented in this in this in this software to add uh, background layers, background maps. Okay, okay, great. So thank you for following us. Thank you for uh, for for viewing this video. What we are? We are Hatari Labs, and what is Hatari Labs? Hatari Labs is a website dedicated for the knowledge sharing in open source software. Um, let me uh, let me show you our website. 
oops okay this is our website we have lots of tutorials mostly on groundwater modeling mo uh, hydraulic modeling and gis so relapse and um, we have a facebook account a twitter account we have as well uh, a newsletter and then we have this YouTube channel where we will post many, many tutorials, mostly on modeling, GIS, and programming. Okay, so if, if you like our videos, if you like the way that we explain our concept, please give it a like to the video. And if you like as well, you can share our post, okay, through your social networks. Once again, my name is Ol Montoya. Thank you for following us. And I hope to see you in coming tutorials. And please have a great day. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.